I'm also a small business owner. I've been a small business owner for 28 years. I have nine employees. And for 25 years, I've been trying to figure out how to find affordable health insurance for myself, my family, and my employees. Until recently, some of you have heard this story many times, I was paying $104,000 per year for four employees. That's nine covered lives inside of our plan. That's also a health insurance plan that has a $5,000 family deductible. Over the last three years, the rates on our plan went up 67.7%. My story is typical. Small businesses like mine are the famous job creators. But we pay 18% more for health insurance coverage than the largest businesses in this country. Our premium costs on average have increased 113% over the last nine years. Too often, small businesses cannot afford the skyrocketing cost of health insurance. In fact, only 39% of small businesses in our state currently provide health insurance to their workers. But we in Common Ground and IEF didn't just wring our hands about these outrageous numbers. We formed a health care team and launched the Common Ground Health Care Cooperative. More than 50 volunteers worked for two years to create this cooperative. Now let me have the members of our health care team and our Common Ground board members stand up. These are the people we owe our thanks to. Don't be shy. Please stand up. Stand up. This team that we developed conducted 150 research meetings with healthcare experts and more than 30 group listening sessions with 367 small businesses, nonprofits, and individuals to document these struggles that I've just described and to test the idea of forming our own health insurance cooperative. Then last spring, Common Ground itself, the board of directors, approved the formation of the Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative, which is a separate nonprofit corporation governed by the members who will purchase insurance through the cooperative. In October of last year, Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative submitted an application to the federal government for a loan under the Affordable Care Act to capitalize our new company. I am privileged to announce today that the Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative, and this is where I get my big smile, <laughs> has received a federal loan for $56.4 million to capitalize our new company. <laughs> about this moment for three years. <laughs> Any surplus that the Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative <coughs> generates will be used to pay back the loans, keep premiums of our members to a reasonable level, and invest in creative ways to keep our members healthy. So today we begin building a new company which will employ 30 people over the next five years. Second, we begin the process of organizing 30 to 50,000 people from seven counties of southeastern Wisconsin to purchase their health insurance through the Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative. We are going to need a year and a half to build the company, so we will not be enrolling folks until the middle of 2013. And the insurance coverage will begin January 1st of 2014. Many of us would like to begin enrolling much quicker, but we have to be patient. I was ready to sign up last week. In the meantime, those of you who are interested in further information about the Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative can go to our new website, which is now live today, commongroundhealthcare.org, the website is listed in your uh, brochure. If you are interested, we welcome small businesses, nonprofits, and, and individuals 
who want to find out about the cooperative as an alternative for their health insurance to sign up, receive our newsletter, and you can follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Before I close, let me formally thank the staffs and representatives of the Federal Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services and the Wisconsin Office of the Commissioner of Insurance for their professionalism, cooperation, and support for our loan application. This is a great day for Common Ground, for the Industrial Areas Foundation, and for the Common Ground Healthcare Cooperative. It is a great day for everyone who has struggled over the years to provide affordable health insurance for themselves, their families, and their employees. We thank everyone who has made this great day possible. Thank you.